the command line bullpine here and welcome back to let's play pc building simulator so two i should say not just one uh let's jump into our email and see what we got left here i think we finished all of our oh we have spam mail now got brains have you got brains we want them here at reanimated systems we have real hunger for talent that's right we're looking for the smartest folks with the biggest juiciest brains to come and join us we can't get enough Think you've got what it takes come and visit us for an in-person evaluation if we like what we see you'll stay for lunch and become one of us <laughs> why wait this is a once in a lifetime opportunity reply now let us find out what you're really made of reanimated systems shamble street and necropolis <laughs> all right sticking point oh this is just a follow-up to our stickers one many thanks for the stickers i can already tell i will spend many hours staring deep into those eyes Plumbing the false depths of these printed windows to a soul that does not exist. Emoji, emote, smileys, but who's really smiling? What can we smile? What can a smile truly mean when expressed as an abstract concept? No doubt it is beyond your understanding, but that's my job to take the incomprehensible and render it coherent. You have been a great help. Except with all those fancy words, it makes it very hard to read what you're saying. Uh huh, no, I don't want you to actually slap me, but I thought I'd get your attention. Slap me with a burger? Okay. Anyway, I'm Jill and I manage the burger bar around the corner. Best burgers in town if you ask me, but I would say that. Haha. -ha. Have this old PC for here for years. There's nothing fancy that does the paperwork. It does look a bit drab though. I wonder if you could slap a bit slap a big fat juicy burger sticker on the side of it. I've seen them, so I know they're out there. How about sticking five more food on there as well? It'll be hilarious. Apply stickers to case for burger. Apply stickers to case food. Okay. Sure. Exciting, exciting sighting. Robin Millworm here, chief twitcher of the Royal Conchair Ornithological Society. We're dedicated to observing preserving birds of all kind. Unfortunately, I've gotten myself into a bit of a flap. <laughs> Some classic ornithological humor there. Haha. -ha. I've recently set up cameras in my back garden to the recordings to record the comings and goings of all manner of common birds. These cameras are hooked up to a master computer, which I keep safely nestled in the branches of a tree. It's able to put the, pull the footage I wanted from the BC, and you'll never guess what I discovered. An entire family of lesser spotted gooblers nesting right in my back garden. Needless to say, this is an extremely rare opportunity to study unusual and reclusive species, but my computer is saying I'm running out of this space. I'm in desperate need of an upgrade before this chance is lost forever. A friend tells me they already have one Terry, one Terry bite. <laughs> driving my computer and then another terry should be enough is this right thanks in advance robin worm 2000 gigs of storage probably just order another one of these huh would be my guess pull this back up Flip this slap that bad boy in there i now get it got it good all right now, should we try to buy just a random piece of junk computer? Let's see. Spares and repairs. Wow, it already has estimated profit. It's kind of weird. I mean, this one has the highest amount of profit right here. 207. Intel Pentium broken... Z490. You have to replace the motherboard, which isn't the simplest thing to replace, but sure. So you get it in the same day. It's weird that these would show up on the same day, but other stuff doesn't. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's see what you've got. You've got a MSI MPG Z490. Uh, G Z490. We just add that to the basket. I don't think we added to a job. Okay. That should be that. Turn power off. Could save the game, but I think we're okay. They made it a lot easier to keep track of things. It used to be like before I would leave, I would save the game so I can go back and order new stuff if I some 
if for some reason I forgot something, but ew, I don't know which one of these is which. Yeah, that one needs the upgrade, so it's in the right spot. This one needed the stickers, so it is going to go here. Burger. Shapes, warning signs, symbols, emojis, bumpers, games, food. Here's the burger. Wish you could resize the stickers. Oh, wait, hold on. Zoom, TPC, scale the sticker, control. There we go. I was going to say, it seemed like it had to be possible. Can I rotate the sticker, though? Alt. There we go. Uh, it's weird. It kind of got caught up on stuff. And I do it like that. And that. Sure. Good enough. I can live with it. Easy money. <laughs> All right. Email accepted. Slap me with a burger. Here we go. You need the extra hard drive. That's pretty simple. Uh, did I not pick up the boxes? I did not pick up the boxes. <laughs> Gonna say pretty sure I bought the item. Still haven't had any custom cabling requests, but we gotta gotta be ready to start encountering those. That was pretty common in the last game was people would ask for specific cables. If you didn't pay attention, it could get you in a little bit of trouble. Double check this email, make sure he isn't saying that it's running slow or something. Doesn't seem like it. Yeah. All good. Absolutely send it. And then, let's work on this bad boy. So we get extra money for like case customization and stuff. So, we'll have to pay attention to that. Lots of cabling to be undone here since we gotta go all the way down to the motherboard. Uh, that screw was like in, <laughs> like not normal. Oh, why I'm cleaning the CPU and the CPU's... Oh, wait, the CPU isn't broke. CPU's good. It's motherboard this time. Oh, no, in the old game, you had to click on just the little latch thing, not the... Not the outer shield there. That's why I was trying to click on it and it wasn't letting me. Uh, I forgot that motherboards. <laughs> the motherboards of this game are a real pain to install at the start. We need to get the. <laughs> it shouldn't make you do the. Hold on. Surely you don't. Ah, crap. No, 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 no. Oh. Okay, that's unfortunate that they haven't changed that. You shouldn't have to uninstall the standoffs. There's no, no real reason for that. As long as you're putting in the same size motherboard. There's no reason to take these out. Yeah, this is what this is why we have to buy the upgrade for like a auto standoff install, because this is absolute insanity. Okay, that's the broken used one. 
Use this one. Ah, uh, geez, Rick. It's a... Quite a bit of work here. Very time consuming. <laughs> oh, no. It's not an exaggeration. Messing around with the motherboard is like the most annoying thing you have to do. PC building. Okay. Let's get everything all slapped back in. Oops, wrong tool. Cables last here, actually. Uh, let's see. Ooh, I don't remember. Oh, well, it didn't have a broken RAM, so it's got to be this one, right? Graphics card. Ooh, it could be any of these. I didn't pay attention. Put this one in, it would be an upgrade anyway. Might be able to sell it for more. Worst case scenario. Might actually match better than the MSI one anyway. Although it is also an MSI motherboard. Okay, nothing else had to be taken out, right? See, that's broken. Might as well sell things that are broken. Not like I can... Not like I can use them unless they've added something to the game. Let's do cables, but let's change the cables. Ribbon, plastic, striped, orange, and red. Seems like the most customized thing that we could do. This is probably not a modular motherboard, though, so it might not matter. Yeah, it's not a... Not a... Uh, We have one connector that's custom. <laughs> now, these used computers are probably ones that we do need to double check to make sure they don't have viruses. Because we got no email about like what's in them or not. Like, who knows? Eh... That was weird. You saw me click that two or three times, right? Hey, I can turn XMP on, probably. There you go. Give it a little kick in the pants with XMP. The fact that this looks so stock tells me there's probably no viruses on it. Like, I feel like, uh, if these things were going to maybe have viruses or something on them, they would probably give them custom backgrounds and stuff, but it seems like it's probably just the fault, right? Yeah. All right. Let's take you. Customize you for the heck of it. Maybe should have done this while the motherboard was out of it. Uh, let's go ahead and do hard. Do not apply on glass. <laughs> I don't really want to apply it like on the... <laughs> dust filter. Wonder. It might not let me do this. What if I do this? In fact, what if I also take off the side panel? I'm just curious. No? It's a new game. Why don't we uh, test the limits of what we can do? I'm not sure how long we'll be playing this on the channel anyway. 
unable to customize the PC in the case of the missing parts. Uh, that's unfortunate. Boo game, boo. You should let me remove the dust filter so I can paint this, but not the dust filter, because painting the dust filter is an incredibly poor idea. <laughs> it will no longer function as a dust filter like that. At least if it's like a fabric mesh. Maybe it's not a fabric mesh. Maybe it's just... Uh, Maybe it's just fine, hard plastic, but still. Point remains. Okay, how do we sell this dangle hunk of junk? It is overclocked, it is customized, it's not named. Customize the LED lights. Do you even have? I guess we should plug it in and find out, huh? Five star bongle rating. It's not going to get custom water cooling. I couldn't do anything about the cables. But we can try to do lighting. Might as well try to get, like, as much margin on this thing as we can. It's nice that we got the overclock credit just for turning on XMP. Think you can get more than 50, or do you think it does any overclock isn't good enough? One way to find out, I suppose. We would probably put, like, a 5% a overclock on the GPU if we wanted to. Install lighting. lot of apps. <laughs> I don't know what all these apps are for. It's not OCCT. That's the test to make sure overclock is stable. It's, uh, maybe we don't have it. Whatever you use for the GPU overclock. I don't see it here. Not worry about it then. Select all. Let's see, you got orange coloration. Static. I don't know. What color would go good with the orange? Honestly, I kind of just like the white. Why not? Oh, I saved this as a preset. Probably didn't need to do that. Now. Okay, now you're worth 50 more dollars. Edit computer name. I don't know. This is the MSI Orange RX 560. And there's no reason we should give this like a special name. Like, you know, the name should probably just be self explanatory, right? There's a benchmark score listed there. I wonder if we can, if we did overclock it, if it would do better. Just leave it there, right? Okay, let's knock these out of our list. Oh yeah, I forgot that's different. Don't need to flag them. Inbox, bits and parts. Spears and repairs. Man, you could probably just... You could probably just buy the used PCs and then resell them. I guess that might not level you up, though. That might just give you uh, money. Hi there, it's Chuck from Chuck's Wood Chucking and Chopping Services. There's no limit on the amount of size of wood we will chop and chuck for you. Believe in sustainability, only chop and chuck from managed forests. Anyway, I digress. 
The PC we use in the wood chucking factory has become so full of wood pictures, files, old data, and general rubbish. I'm worried that I'm going to lose all my data. I definitely don't want to be that. Definitely don't want that to happen with all the timber suppliers and accounts I have on there. The hard drive was small to start with, so it could give me a new sleek fast hard drive with as much space, with more space, and clone the existing one so I don't lose anything. Install the A-Data Ultimate SU650 and then clone the ISO. OS cloning is a method for copying operating system from one hard drive to another. You'll need an OS cloning USB drive for this. We've added one to the tools in your inventory. We noticed that. You can install the app directly from the USB. Okay. Let's open up the shop. It's the A-Data FCU650. This one. Man, it's so nice just being able to assign it to a job. Hi, my name is Aiden. I'm number one animal fam in the world. I have a PC I used to play games. Baboon Tycoon is my fave. It's pretty great because my sister built it for me and shows all about computers, but the new expansion I just bought, Macaque Mayhem, doesn't work on it. It's really annoying to me. Looked it up online. Apparently, a PC that can benchmark 2000 should be able to play it. Ooh, so now we have the benchmark PCs, huh? Should be able to play it properly. Can you upgrade mine so it can do that? Can't wait to play it. Aiden, age 39. <laughs> It sounded like they're like super young, but they're 39. Operations Director, Royal Society for Animal Protection and Care. Please don't tell my sister I need to upgrade the PC she built. She'll be sad. This job requires you to use the 3D Mark and parts ranking apps to help improve the performance of the customer's PC to match the desired benchmark. You'll need to install the apps on your PC and check the email carefully to find out what they need. And it's a pretty good processor. So definitely don't need to mess with the processor. GTX 750 Ti. So is it implying that I need to look at... Will it run? It might not actually be a game on here. There's a lot more in this game than there was in the last one. <laughs> I don't think it's in here. So I think it's just uh, part ranking. I think these are benchmarks in 3D marks. I don't think. Just need 2000 or higher. So the R9 2800 or 280 or GTX 970 or 1650 should all be good enough. 2000. Graphics cards by Ascending. Ten fifty Ti should do it. Some of them are not quite there though, so we might want to do sixteen fifty to be sure. There's a sixteen fifty for two hundred ten. Email, how much money are you giving me here? Four hundred. That should be enough, then. Hopefully I'm understanding that properly. Email. No other emails. Drop. Check out. Right now. I stop turning the lights off in there and start turning them off over here. Probably go better for me. But we'll handle this day in the next episode. I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, remember to hit the like button. Keep the conversation going in the comments and subscribe if you'd like to see more. Until next time, I hope you have a good day.